Here's something you see a lot in Southern Italy, not so much in America. Quick, pickled, very flavorful eggplant. You get two flat sides, that just makes life a lot easier, you know? So nothing's rolling around really. Very precise mixture. One third champagne vinegar, two thirds water. How much? Enough to fill the eggplant. Maybe have some just poking out the top. Coriander seed, how much do you like it? I like it. So a lot of hardcore people will tell you that you've got to dry these out with salt and weights for hours. And I think it's really silly because you're boiling it in water and vinegar. So why are you taking water out when you're just gonna put it back in anyway? Skip that six hour step. Eggplant into a pot that is on high heat. Clove of garlic, put your knife on top, smash it, skin comes off relatively easily that way. All right, bring it to a boil. All of our flavor for the dish comes from these various ingredients. We won't be using any salt, so I highly recommend olives. I like red ones. I think they look more beautiful. For two pretty small eggplant, 10, 10 olives. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, yeah, 10. Um, I got some capers. They were packed in salt. I'm just gonna chop them up here. A chili pepper. Whatever fresh herbs you have. Parsley, basil, oregano. See, now this looks pretty pretty, so let's just kind of <laughs> All right, when this comes to a boil over here, you'll see the skin of the eggplant start turning brown. Kind of like that. Five minutes boil. Let's start putting it in the jar here. Let's do layers of stuff, all right? All right, so tonight I have Phoebe Ryan from Town Hall on the show, and she's a vegan. So I wanted to give her something that she probably doesn't have very often. Who makes pickled eggplant? No one. No one makes pickled eggplant. Get some compression, yeah? Don't be afraid. Keep going layers. Ooh, look at that. Get that pepper somewhere in the middle. Push, 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 push. Okay, that looks really, really pretty. Now we want to fill in the gaps. That's gorgeous, that's different. 10 days in the fridge. The olive oil solidifies a little bit, so you definitely want to pull it out about 25 minutes before you're gonna eat it. Something that's very, very satisfying is uh, eating, I don't know if you've ever had bread with olive oil before, but essentially this is very flavorful, olive oil. And then to make it extra special and, and really cut through the vinegar, just a little bit of Pecorino Romano in there is like the most killing Bruschetta. All right, mm -hmm. Francesco, you'll really like this one. Thank you. Sono sicuro. <laughs> what is it? No, I made, I made some like quick pickled eggplant. Yeah. They, uh, I got family down in Calabria, which is pretty close to Campania, and, and grandma makes this. Why don't you take a piece of bread, put on the bread with a little bit of the pecorino romano. Okay. It's, okay, how am I supposed to take it? Just grab it with your fingers. That would make my fingers? Yeah. Pecorino. Okay. Are you asking is about pecorino? Okay. It's pecorino. Okay, pecorino is the is the cheese. Cheese. It's the cheese. <laughs> you know. Oh, but, <laughs> but what does the word really mean? Uh, little sheep. Right. So yeah, I knew it. Yes. Obviously, you shouldn't put the cheese. No, but I want to eat this. Is it okay? Mm -hmm. Good. Oh. This <laughs> is um, is sottolio, no? Oh, oh yeah, vulgar. sottolio. Under olive oil. Sotto olio. Sotto olio. And it's it's like um. And then I want. It's it's very. Big meat. That people used to do it, especially in the south of Italy. Right. So mm. Naples, um, Calabria, Sicilia. Mm. You know. Mm. Yeah. It's really, 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 really brava, good. Brava, brava, brava. I took a really cool picture. Okay. And and I and you are the drummer who makes the thunder sound. Oh my right? God. Right. Right. Holy oh. sh. Woo. I'm I'm wow. sorry for 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 the sh but but man, this <laughs> is. That's cool. Wow. <laughs> the thunder. <laughs> what, what's going what, Okay. The it's, thunder it's maker. Awesome. No, no I just, I'm just curious. What, what, what just, how did you, did you, did you think about the 
thunder. Then, and does that not mean the thunder man, the thunder maker? Tornatore. Il tornatore. Il tuono. No, how do you say Il that? Il tornatore. Si. Tornatore. It means the thunderer? Yes. Thunderer. <laughs> no, I, actually, I, I've never really seen this word in Italian. I know, I invented it, and I'm telling you what it means. It means the thunder maker man. The, <laughs> the thunderist. <laughs> The, the, the thunder, thunder, the thunder man, the man. thunder maker man. I think it's brilliant. And yeah, man. So, I was gonna say <laughs> that really is tasty. Can but I let's go play. Let's that? go play a song. Let's Bring play some music. Closer. I think we should. We should probably end with playing mood. Mm -hmm. Should I wear my mood ring? Should I wear my Change from grains to blue 